Hey, what's up, cats and kittens? And shout out to all my Cerebralites. It's me, the Cerebral Diva, back with another episode of Reality, and that's T-E-A, because I give it to you scalding hot. So grab your cups, grab your saucers, gather around, and let's all partake in this libation of Real Housewives of Atlanta tea. And before we go another further, as my mother would say, <laughs> I'm going to give you a couple of seconds to find that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I need you to do all of those, okay? Um, so let's dive right into this. So ever since the reunion ended a couple of weeks ago, we've all been sort of waiting to see exactly which card Candy was going to play. Um, people have been, there have been rumblings and murmurings about whether or not she was going to sue Phaedra, whether or not she was going to counter sue Johnny, um, and, um, or we, we knew that she was going to counter sue Johnny, but now it looks like a judge has actually approved the lawsuit because he's found Candy's lawsuit to be with merit. Um, her suit argues that Johnny breached the non-disclosure agreement when he made statements about her on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Burris says that she did not know Winston was unhappy with his pay until August 2016 when the show was filming. She also defended herself saying Winston was paid for all of his time and she maintained that he was an independent contractor. In Burris's defamation lawsuit, she argues that Winston alleges she alleges that he's messed up her reputation and subjected her to ridicule and hatred. The judge agreed with her briefs via the evidence he reviewed and now Burris is seeking damages from Winston. Now, I think if, if, if Candy sues um, Johnny and lose and wins, that he needs to be over at Phaedra's office, um, <laughs> having her chip in on, on on making sure that Candy is compensated because Phaedra to me was really the mastermind behind this lawsuit. I mean, granted Johnny went to her, but I think that Phaedra really didn't have Johnny's best interests at heart. You know, what she was out to do was hurt Candy and she used Portia and Johnny as pawns in, in her game of chess. And so now, unfortunately, Johnny is going to have to pay for it. And what's interesting is because, to me, I think Johnny would have been better served by just trying to maintain his relationship with Candy. Now, I've never worked with Candy. I'm not sure if she's difficult to work with, but based on the personality that I believe her to have, um, from what I see on the show, she looks to be like a, a, like she can be a staunch businesswoman, like she's about her business when she needs to be, but she also looks to be a pretty fair person. And I think it would behoove Johnny to maintain that relationship long term and to be smart and to, 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 to sort of play it to his advantage. If I were Johnny and I were on The Real Housewives of Atlanta and I were working with Can Candy, I would try to be in every scene I could possibly be in. I would be at Candy's beck and call. I would be doing the best possible work because I would see The Real Housewives of Atlanta to be a commercial for my brand. Even though Candy is quote unquote the star of the show, if you're smart enough, you can do your own product placement, your product being you. But for whatever reason, Johnny just did not play his cards right. He got in his feelings. And this is one of the things, one of the most common mistakes I think people make in business is because people make emotional decisions when it comes to business. When it comes to business, you have to extract emotions and put emotions on the shelf and just have tunnel vision. And all you see in front of you is your bottom line. And unfortunately, Johnny didn't see that. So um, I feel bad for him to some degree, but... Maybe it's a lesson learned. Maybe this is a bot lesson for Johnny. But the real um, lawsuit that I'm waiting to see is whether or not Candy, how Candy is going to play this um, potential lawsuit with Phaedra. So look, right now it looks like poor Johnny, um, he's going to be paying out of both ends for quite some time. Um, and I guess we'll still have to wait and see what happens with Phaedra. So anyhow, you guys, that's it for this episode of Reality. As I said earlier, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you follow me across all social media. That's Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And as always in closing, people, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. No, remember to live better. <laughs> it's so robotic. When you've done it so many times, it becomes repetitious. Remember to live better, love harder, and think smarter. It's me, the Cerebral Diva. I will talk to you guys again soon. Have a great day.